All right, yes, yeah, so I'm going to continue. All right, with the second part. And I'm going to continue reading. It says, and cause them to be written in paper, for they are faithful and true. Yes, yeah, somebody came by, talked to me, somebody I know. thought they were going to harass me, but it's all good. Um, for they are faithful and true. All this is going to come to pass, man. Okay, here it is. I'm out here on so-called Halloween day, Halloween Eve or whatever. All right, this is nothing but demons out here, man, or about to be. It says, fear not the imaginations against thee. Let not the incredulity of them trouble thee that speak against thee. So what we're doing, what we're doing is a good thing. All right, preaching this word is a good thing. So don't be mindful or, or, or don't be bothered by what people say, man. Okay, here it is around here in righteous apparel. These garments, these people all dressed like bug outs. You know, what do they have to say? Nothing. It says, for all the unfaithful shall die in their unfaithfulness, man. So whoever doesn't believe in Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, whoever doesn't worship the Heavenly Father and His Son is going to get put to death. All right, that's just what the Bible says. Okay. One of the Ten Commandments was, all right, that you have no other gods other than the Heavenly Father, whose true name is Yahweh, which means He is or He exists. Okay? Yahweh. And His only begotten Son, whom the world ignorantly calls Jesus Christ, His real name is Yahweh Shai. All right, which are so-called black men. Okay? The Creator and His Son. Okay, so behold, saith the Lord, I will bring plagues upon the world, the sword, famine, death, and destruction. See, that's what's coming to this world, man. You got these people that are that are celebrating uh, Halloween, you know, which is pagan. Okay, instead of worshiping Yahweh and keeping the high holy days, they want to keep pagan pagan days, unholy days, you know. Well, all these people, man, that are out with their mind all boggled, their mind all washed up in madness, and they don't understand what's about to take place, man. What's coming to this world? Okay? Because nothing good is coming to this world, man. All right? We just read that, that death and destruction is coming, man. Okay? You know, famine, plague. You know, we just got through, uh, uh, or we're getting through, I don't really know where it's at right now. But you had, uh, uh, you had, uh, what do you call it? Uh, the C-19. Okay. Corona. What happened to that, man? What happened to that big old scare? All right. It came and it went. But you're going to have real plagues, man, where you see uh, blood coming out of people's eyes, man. People coughing up blood. People literally dropping dead in front of you. You know, people that stop breathing. Okay. Real plagues are going to come to this place, man. Not some little bullshit where you're sick for a week or two. No, nah, man, some real plagues. Okay. Some real plagues that these hospitals ain't going to be able to control. The CB, CDC ain't going to be able to stop, man. They ain't going to have no answers. They ain't going to have no cure. No so-called vaccine. They ain't going to have that for you. You're just going to be dropping dead out here, man. It says, the sword, famine, death, and destruction, man. World War Three. You know, civil war, because there's going to be a civil war. All right, you got them, they just tried to uh, assassinate Pelosi. Or fuck that Pelosi, whatever. So there's all types of shit going on within their within their system, within their, uh, when it comes to politics, man. Okay. All these politics is going to lead to civil war. You got two different parties. It's supposed to be the United States of America. Here it is, all these people are divided, man. All 
tell you before dividing me. This is a loop. Let's see if I can find it. This is Luke chapter 11. Yeah, Luke chapter 11, verse 17. But he, knowing their thoughts, said unto them, Every kingdom divided against itself is brought to desolation. In America, it's divided against itself, man. You got so called uh, white versus everybody, white versus black, white versus brown. And I say black, so called black, because uh, nobody's black. We're all different shades of brown and different shades of red. So you got the white man versus everybody, man. But we're supposed to be united. Okay, you got you got Republican versus Democrat. Okay, you got racism going on, like I just mentioned. But we're all supposed to be united. Everything's divided. Okay, you got the household divided over 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 uh, different ideals, different morals, different politics. You got the mother against the daughter, the father against the son, siblings against each other, siblings against their parents, whether it be son, daughter, mother, father, over over their sexual preference, orientation.